M0 FXB Hamtech, welcome back to the channel. Someone's asked me to show my MQTT working. So what is MQTT and Meshtastic? Meshtastic is an off-grid network, so you don't normally use the internet, but you can link to the internet and the MQTT is described as allowing the local mesh to communicate with the internet. So let me just show you how I turn mine on. You've got three dots here now. This isn't the setup from the beginning. This is just, uh, you've already set it up and you just wanna see what MQTT is like. Now you can see all the messages just scrolling in now. Yeah, a few there from my friend M6LSJ as well, because we've been um, setting this up together. But anyway, so if we go three dots, then go to radio configuration. On user, if you're a ham, turn on this bit that says licensed ham radio, okay? My friend's very busy sending photographs. Hopefully he's got it working. Anyway, then you go back, then go to channel. And we'll click the channel and just, when you click the channel, or we'll tap it on your phone, because the right hand side is my phone screen. And on the left is just the map that we get. So if you look here, uplink enabled, downlink enabled, okay? So save that. When you click save, it's gonna reboot your node. When you can see my node, I've got it in a bender case and there it is there. Okay, very nice, very nice indeed. There you go. And also in the map, if you look at the map here on the left, you can see if I tap my location, let's go, the map I'm using is the one by Liam Cottle. If I tap my location, it's showing me there, M0FXB Hamtech. I changed the name here at home, uh, and then it's all showing up there. It says I'm online uh, 14 minutes ago, ETC. So it's all showing that it's working there, battery voltage, uh, and I'm using a Helltech version three, which is good news. And I put it in this case, I've actually got a GPS module in there. So anyway, once you hit save, then go back and let it reboot. Go down to, MQTT, click it, and you wanna make sure you've turned this on. Now, I 100 million percent, don't run this for very long because you'll hog the network. But anyway, MQTT is enabled. I have, um, I don't really want to encrypt, so I'll turn that off to be honest. But I think if you select ham at the beginning, it won't anyway, but I will turn that off. Um, proxy to client enabled, I'm gonna click send. When it sends, it reboots my device, which you can see it rebooting. Now there is one setting in that also tell, asks you if you want to hide your MQTT messages. If you go back one, let's go down to LoRa. Here, yeah, see LoRa, click. And we've got our radio frequency selected there, 868. Ignore MQTT is turned off, because I think by default that would normally be on, but anyway, it's off. And use modem preset, okay, not use that. Uh, and the modem preset looks like it's long fast. I haven't done any offset. So that all looks good, then we'll go back. Now position, go down to the one that says position. I have got a GPS unit, but it's, you know, it doesn't get a lock unless I go outside of the house. So I would recommend in that situation, use fixed position, and then that gives you the option to actually add your fixed position, okay? Which is here, yeah? And I use a site called Longitude Latitude to get that. Uh, there's too many adverts on it, but it does work. You can see it there. It's called la latlong.net, latlong.net. Look that one up. And then the map I said is called meshtastic.liamcottle.net. And that's the one that seems to work well for me. Then we go back. And if we click, go back again. The first one is you can send a message, okay? Right, and then the second one, you can go choose that and you know, I've, see the messages have gone out since I've been connected to the mesh. Now I recommend you just get up high and use your antenna and don't use, don't use MQTT. Um, anyway, just I want you to see it working, what happens. But anyone that's added their location, 
it's going to show up here. And when you click their location, I won't click it now because I don't want to put their location um, and their map and all that on the channel. But look, you can see lots of people here that have turned it on. Uh, gateway and um, yeah, this is all coming through. There's me again. If you click the third one along, it's ham tech look. And that's to that's, I think if you scan that with someone else's device, they'll go still, it'll put you on the same channel. And that's my device there, which I renamed just by clicking on the top here and renamed it. But right now, I'm going to turn off MQTTT, uh, three dots, radio config, and I highly recommend you do this MQTT, turn it off, and click send, and that turns it off. Hope this helps you, and I'll be doing another video showing this via my PC. I'll go close and back to my messages, back again, and look, I'm still going to receive items, but I'll be receiving it via RF only. Bye for now, 7-3, all the best.